Tier 9 Czech Premium Heavy Tank. This tank has got a 122mm caliber gun with 440 alpha damage and it's an autoloader tank with 4 shells. So, the firepower of this tank, we have 440 alpha damage which can high up to 550. The HE is 530 which can high up to 663. The penetration values of this ammunition loadout, we have here on the AP, we have 257 millimeters of base penetration value. On the APCR, we have 325 millimeters of base penetration value. And on the HE, we have 68 millimeters of base penetration value. Now the shell velocity speed is 1040 meter per sec for the AP, 1270 meter per sec for the APCR and 1040 for the HE. This tank has time of the magazine is 35 seconds, which means the, inter the intra clip reload time is 3.5 seconds between the shells and the clip size is 4 capacity, which means this tank has 4 shells in the magazine. Aim time of this tank is 3 seconds. The accuracy of this gun is 0.44 in dispersion value. Gun elevation, we have 80 degree of gun depression and 20 degree of gun elevation. This tank can take up to 40 ammo capacity and the DPM of this tank is roughly around 3.5. 5k. The mobility of this tank, the forward speed is 36 km per hour and the reverse speed is 16 km per hour. The hull reverse speed is 26 degree per sec, gun reverse speed is 26 degree per sec. These are a normal average heavy tank stats, nothing special. The HP of this tank we have here 1750 HP. The armor of this tank, this is the turret armor, we have the front, side and rear and the whole armor front, side and rear. So this means looks like this tank doesn't really have any good armor not in not even in the turret because 270 millimeter frontal armor is uh i mean it's weak and as you can see from this image i assume here for the first let's take a closer look here so first where i see the weak spots first of all we have a big cupola here we have this vision device port which also will be this is flat and also here will be a weak spot in the plate here we have a driver's hatch which also angled in this way which means it is a weak spot and so on and even the gun that is 270 i assume here weak spot again weak spot weak spot and a lot of weak spot on this tank the view range of this tank is 390 meter and the signal range is 730 meter the crew of this tank here here we have commander gun driver and the loader of this tank so conclusion about this tank is this tank can do 1760 burst uh, burst damage and if you high roll for like 500 that is um, over 2k damage and that is really really good the armor penetration values i mean 258 it's okay on the apcr 325 apcr is okay the shower speed is good definitely uh, dpm is also good because this will go down to 32 31 second that's definitely good a degree of gun depression is good you have a lot of ammo, ammo i mean 40 ammo for uh 440 damage that's amazing the view range 390 meter is good now let's talk about what is bad on this tank first of all the bad is uh so let's talk about what is bad on this tank first of all the aim time three second aim time that's bad this version was 0.44 that's bad the aim time feels really long i mean three seconds that's some uh artillery <laughs> aiming time and 0.44 we all know what this means the hp 1750 i mean this is not i mean even tier 8 heavy tank has more hp than this armor so hp no uh, no good armor weak definitely especially in the hole this is a front side and rear so i mean the armor is not good the speed is acceptable but definitely 36 forward and 16 reverse it's a bit better than 35 and uh, 15 so that's not a great deal turns his hole as a heavy tank and turret as a heavy tank because it's a heavy tank so it's nothing special here the only but it the tank looks good the tank looks good for the first look definitely the 440 alpha damage gives it a big thumbs up definitely but it remains to see the armor is how bad is the armor basically i will say that it's okay this tank looks okay and promising not good not bad i mean it's balanced. So thank you guys for watching.